and Victoria Reynolds is with me, makeup artist to the stars. Busy, busy lady that you are. Thank it's great you. to see you. It's lovely to have me. Well, lovely to be here. Thank you. So tell us, just tell us a little bit about your background yeah, in makeup sure. and what you uh, love so much about the Laura Geller range. Yeah, absolutely. So um, I've been a makeup artist for about 10 years now. I work in, um, in the fashion, in the commercial industry. I do events and I do weddings, private clients, um, which is really exciting. I love the kind of you know, variety, I guess. And what does the brand Laura Geller mean to you? So Laura Geller, believe it or not, is one of my biggest inspirations and maybe why I yeah, definitely thought about going into makeup. Um, I love her. I love her products mainly. Um, she, the amount of kind of love and care she puts into them um, her bait range is quite a well-known range. And actually, we've got, uh, obviously, bait products in yeah, this exactly. entire collection. I think what Laura does so, so well is giving us a chance to have a complete look in a box, but then we can really upscale the Definitely. glamour as we can do in this collection. So eight pieces in here. Exactly. And you're going to apply on Sarah, lucky yep, girl, in a wave. moment. Just take us through them, Absolutely. Victoria, exactly what you get in so the box. So as I briefly touched on the baked um, products, which I will explain in more detail when applying on Sarah, we have the Balance and Glow which is a really beautiful, it was actually a cream foundation, which has been baked so it feels and applies a little bit like a powder, but it's still very hydrating, Let's like a cream. Let's take a look at that Absolutely. Not actually seen that So what I love quick, about quick this is it, it, I mean, it looks beautiful in itself. It's um, a kind of swirled marble effect, and Wonderful. there's six different uh, cream pigments in there, actually, that have been baked, and that's what forms this beautiful product. So you um, get product. the foundation. You get the foundation. Then we've got a lovely three-piece um, eyeshadow set. Ooh. Again, beautiful baked products. Look we've got the colors. champagne color in the Baroque, um, a beautiful kind of torpy color in the cafe, and then a mauve plummy in Roma. We, um, all, we all caught our breath. <gasps> yeah. Sarah and I went, oh, look at those colors. I know. Colors. Well, don't Brilliant. worry. We'll be applying so them all. all three there. What and then you've got the Style Lash, which is a really good seller of Laura's. Um, it's particularly good for intense lengthening. Um, so if you've got great lashes, or even you know if you've got kind you've of got teeny short, tiny yeah, lashes exactly. Like mine, that's I work. mean, it does everything, but lengthening is what it's uh -huh. all about. And then you've got the amazing Eye Care, which is it's actually a waterproof, but it's um it's called Eye Care because it's for sensitive is that eyes. An eyeliner. It's an eyeliner. Great. And Laura created that because she particularly has very sensitive eyes, so she wanted something with you know intensity but easy to wear on all eyes. Um, and then you've got the, this is quite a new product, and it's the Universal Gel Brow Pencil. Great, you can tell me about that. But then we've got some luscious lip colours here, which are great. lip colours. Um, you've got a little trio of them, so you can use all together, or one, the other two. Um, you've got the beautiful pencil, which is also waterproof lip right. liner. But this is a gloss Sorry, and I'll go the other way, yeah. exactly. So you've got the gloss and Piazza Pink, full coverage, great intensity of colour. And then you've got the Rouge Audrey lipstick, um, which I'll just quickly open. A beautiful kind of classic oh, Audrey Hepburn so actually, color. You know, take a look at those together. So beautiful. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and like I said, you can use one or both together. And then lastly, the tulip waterproof lip liner. All right, so, so make your choice. Oh, sorry, I was yeah. going to say very quickly, you've got fair, deep porcelain and tan in yep. your foundation. So place your order straight away, qvcuk.com. Let's take a look then at the staying power of the foundation and this baked, uh, this kind of baked textures. Sure. What is it about um, the baked qualities that makes so uh, Laura Geller's product so unique? What is so amazing about this particular baked foundation is that it, because it's a cream baked into this little pot, it's got massive kind of hydrating qualities. It's got a lot of emollients which are hydrating and um, essential oils. So like I said, although you feel like it's a powder, it's not going to sit in lines. It's really useful. So not um, cakey, which is what so many of us all. are afraid of. Exactly. Never tried Laura Geller, um, not cakey. And it's a medium to full coverage, but I know a lot of girls that wear it, you know, just a little quick sweep across the face and it really just gives a really lovely sheer kind of, you know, all over glow. How important is it for you to work with products like that, that you can kind oh, of start, so you can have important. a light base or you can build up? Yeah, massively important. You know, I might be on a set um, or you know on a fashion show and you've got an array of models with different skin tones and different skin um, you know kind of smoothness and I just want to go to one a uh, one product um, that will work for all and some girls may need a little bit more coverage or in areas you know this hides pigmentation um, discoloration of the skin it's just it's amazing for all skin tones excellent and also you get that little bit of illumination there oh, I can see the very fine particles it? on Sarah's skin which really that, give her that glow so in terms of being an, an, an everyday foundation this yeah. would work yes absolutely and um, what's lovely about it is it's got a little mirror in the 
uh, top, so you can literally oh, tuck that in your handbag and you've got everything for application. Great. Of course, online look uh, on our website for all the brushes that you can use with this as well. But take a look at Sarah, actually. She looks fabulous. Nice. Really nice skin. Lovely and bright. So onto the eyes, we're Definitely. delving into that lovely, lovely trio there. Exactly. So I'm just applying the um, this beautiful kind of shimmery champagne colour, which is called Baroque, and I'm applying it all across the lid. So from inner corner right to the outside, and I'm actually just going to sweep it under the brow bone because it's a lovely uh, like highlighter, really. So don't be afraid to kind of, well, I, I get excited by this and kind of apply it everywhere, but yeah, do go from, from the lash line all the way up to the brow. Um, and then I'm going to go in with the cafe, which is that beautiful medium torpy colour. And using the same applicator, I'm just going to start in the outer corner and just gently smudge it. Um, a great way to apply this, I always think, is in almost like a little C or on the opposite side, a backward C. And it just really emphasises the eyes, the socket and um, the colour. If you just open a moment, Sarah, if you can look into the camera, this really warm, beautiful brown just makes her eyes pop so much close a moment but um laura is great at creating colors that do work for all skin tones so you could pick up this palette being any skin tone and you know it's well I'm, I'm obsessed with laura geller's actually <laughs> baked eyeshadows i've got a palette this big i think it's got about oh, 16 wow, in you. and i just love color sure. and so it works obviously because um laura works with uh, making foundations for very fair porcelain skin that kind the of nicole name. kidman skin and then through exactly. to mine as well so it's great to, that she does the colors too so um, would you use the eyeshadows um, separately as well as blending? Because some people aren't quite oh, a, a kind of very okay with the blending. You're a professional, but we're not all professionals. Well, yeah, I think the great thing about Laura is that she makes these products that aren't scary for people, you know, that you could pick up the palette and um, use one colour or use them all together, um, and it's going to work. So, yeah, you don't have to be a pro. And the thing with makeup is that well, what, I love, what I love about it and also what I love that Laura loves about it, if that makes sense, <laughs> is that... She, um, sorry, just close a moment. Um, yeah, so she, I'm sorry, I'm going a bit. Nice. And so what are you using at the minute? The uh, eyeliner? Exactly. So it's the, the eye care eyeliner. It's waterproof, but oh. really, really gentle on uh, sensitive eyes. Great. So if like me, a contact lens wearer, you've got trouble with your eyes, exactly. it'll be great. Don't worry about that. And is that all you needed? You only just popped a little bit. Just look at I Sarah, did. actually. You can see you just popped a little bit on the outer. On the outter, yeah. outer corner. So just close a moment. And the, the great thing about this pencil is that it's almost got an applicator end to it. So um, it's got a little smudger. So if you want more of a like smoky eye, then you can just quite messily uh, apply the pencil which is nice especially if you know you you're you not such a pro. don't have to reach for another brush. Exactly. Oh my goodness. And um, just smudge it out so yeah you can have quite a neat sharp line or you can have a really lovely smoky soft uh, smudgy Excellent. effect. I'll tell you what Victoria your challenge should you choose to accept it we've got a few more minutes to, to jot through everything else so the mascaras yep. we know another iconic line in terms of teeny tiny lashes so you can moment. use those well it's a and fab it'll, brush it'll make you look as if you've got longer lashes yeah, it's, an, it's a really lengthening, intensive mascara. Um, and I love the fact that it's a really small brush because it means that, you know, if you do have smaller, kind of sparser lashes, it's really easy to get in there without getting mascara mm. all over the skin. Now, oh, I can't wait to get to the, <laughs> to get to the lip colours. It? You know, it's all about Audrey Hepburn insp inspiration, yeah. isn't it? That Oscar-winning movie, Roman Holiday. Yeah. Um, and, oh, this is your brow Yeah, so gel. I know you Universal were just brow gel. talking yeah. about Audrey Hepburn, and she's so famous for those beautiful, kind of strong eyebrows and um, you know amongst amongst my work when I'm working with the TV presenters and that kind of thing a massive trend or massive want is gorgeous thick brows. It's big brows yeah. isn't it? It's big, Thank thick, you Audrey yeah. Hepburn. So yeah so Laura's created this gorgeous um, pencil that it really is one shade fits all um, and it's called universal so you don't need to worry about picking the right color Excellent. it's written for you. Great so we've got three pieces here in terms of lip pencil and gloss and uh, lipstick. Sure. What kind of look are you going to create for us? So this is a really beautiful kind of soft rose uh, lip pencil in the shade Tulip. And again, I think it suits all skin tones. I'm just gently blending it into the lip. And it's lovely because it's a really soft, silky formula. And what's the benefit of using a lip pencil before putting so on the gloss or just, the lipstick? It just makes you look really polished. And I think as well, it... You know, if you are kind of out or eating, drinking, chatting, your lipstick eventually will wear off a little bit. Yeah. Um, but the thing with a pencil is it's going to still give you that kind of polished look that 
is you know it's not it's not going to budge and so you you don't need to keep running to the bathroom to top it up yeah you know, exactly or kind of having really to, well or kind of trying to get the compact out and go quick quick application yeah so you'd always use a lip pencil and then you would either or the lipstick yeah the definitely glass? i mean there's no reason you can't use both together um but i think i'm just going to go for the lipstick um it's the rouge audrey so yeah that classic you know when you kind of see audrey hepburn in the posters and the she's posters got that beautiful yeah, rosy little pout you can look divine too with the rouge audrey um so yeah i mean i've, I've blended that in and we're just gonna gently kind of tap on the lipstick um these lipsticks and the lip pencils are really infused with um vitamin e and jojoba oil so i mean i know i'm suffering from quite dry lips at the moment but these products really give you a lovely color but hydrate so right. well and there's nothing worse than applying a lipstick than that is drying because then you don't go back to that brand and lots of customers come back time and time again over 135 star reviews for this collection very quickly then victoria running yeah. out of time how would you sum up this fantastic collection which you also get in school gorgeous box and with some guidance as well it's just an all-in-one kit you don't need to get anything else it's fun have fun with it um, and just create yeah a beautiful Audrey Italian look fantastic thank you very much indeed thank you Sarah thank, thank you Victoria you, Sarah. if you want to get this collection then it's 3825 it's an eight piece collection for you qvcuk.com is the best way for you to get a hold of yours <laughs>